There's a universal belief that music heals. It doesn't hurt if you can have fun in the process. For Emeka Adindu, the magic of dance has proved to be a lifeline against depression and thoughts of self-harm. Salsa was the only thing that could make me smile. All those days I was battling, fighting with my demons, with my past, with my everything. Salsa was the only thing that makes me feel like living. He believes the best way to feel good is to do something physical, and in this case, attach a beat to it. There's no space for you to think about your sorrow, because one, you're thinking about the music, you're thinking about um, the counts, the rhythm. Adindu has been giving free salsa classes since 2007. With most Friday nights attracting 40 people or more, many are finding the dancing more than just therapeutic. It has helped me relieve stress. It has helped me build relationships between people. I've made new friends. And the dance keeps me fit. Health professionals say mental illness is often misunderstood in Nigerian society. It is not a spiritual problem, it is a health problem. You know, people always easily identify um, physical health. Okay, I have malaria, I have diabetes, I have attention. I think it's normal, but then when it comes to their brain being ill, they start trying to find another um, way to explain it away. Instead of knowing that it is one more illness that is a current call from my body malfunctioning, in this case, the brain. Salsa's fun and enjoyable moves are helping to break down barriers, spread awareness and change perceptions about mental illness. Mike Lappel, Al Jazeera.